kid's perspective, the School of Rock experience looks like a dream world they created in their head that actually exists in real life. You know, what's unique about our approach or our method to teaching is that we start with the music. Um, I like to say that if you teach a kid theory, he'll lose interest in music, whereas if you teach him how to play music, he becomes more interested in the theory behind it. School of Rock's a performance-based music school. So these kids are taking private lessons every week and then they're getting a chance to interact with other kids, play incredible music, and it's a really engaging process. The outcome is they get really good. We can take a kid who's never touched a guitar or a bass or a drum, or we can take uh, someone who's played for a multitude of years and we can make them comfortable in our school. The way we gauge a kid's progress is really individually. Like, a kid will come in and they could be anywhere from never touching an instrument to being a seasoned uh, adolescent guitar player. And depending on their path, we gauge their progress. We choose to teach rock and roll music because it's inspirational music. It's passionate music. It's fun music. It's the kind of music that the kids in our program want to play. The teachers at the School of Rock are all professional players. They've been out there and they're able to translate all of that knowledge back to our kids. What's great about the program is that the kids grow at their own pace. If there's someone who's really anxious to learn strumming chords, they can focus on that for a while. And then if there's somebody who really wants to focus on guitar solos, all of it will come into focus and you'll end up learning the entire package. There's a unique approach to teaching at School of Rock. We don't teach music theory to put on shows. We actually put on shows to teach music theory through the works of Zeppelin, the Beatles, Rolling Stones, to Motown, funk and reggae. These kids get out just a wide gamut of music and it's really important to teach them holistically that there's so many styles you can draw from to become an incredible player. Uh, our program actually takes a student and casts them into a show along with many other students and it's a fabulous way to learn teamwork. You learn listening skills. If you've ever played in a band, you have to listen, you have to understand where your part is, you have to know where you come in. And, and through this, this idea of teamwork really comes out. But what I see is they have discipline and focus and they just really have a work ethic now. They build a team spirit that you can't find anywhere else. I think the School of Rock is the closest you'll ever come uh, in an educational format to the reality of the music world. Every child involved at the School of Rock has to learn to appreciate the gifts of the other children. And I'm not really sure what the formula is that the School of Rock has for it. I just know it works and my child is ready for the world because of the last three and a half years that he's spent at the School of Rock. The main benefit is just the network of School of Rocks around the country. I mean, there's nothing like it. That facility allows for so many opportunities for the kids, you know, to really experience music as I've experienced by traveling around the world, by interacting in, in, in the group, uh, the family that is music. It's getting to do something you're not supposed to do as a kid. You look at the television or you look at your record collection and you see all these amazing heroes doing things that you aspire to and you don't think that you're supposed to or even allowed to do that as a kid. but. You get to do that at the School of Rock. You get to be on stage and you get to sing a song that your friends and family and fans are uh, in love with. School of Rock All-Stars are simply the best of the best. Each summer, our All-Stars tour, just like any real band would. And this is an opportunity for our very best kids to get connected with all of the best kids across the country and have an authentic touring experience. The All-Stars program really turns students into full-on true believers that they can do this forever. My dream was to play at BB King's when I saw the All-Stars play with John Anderson at BB King's and I got to play at BB King's on my winter tour. It's basically just rewarding people who have rewarded the program giving back to the kids who have been giving back. Our students, when they're out on the road, are approached by national television. These kids have even been featured on Dancing with the Stars, VH1, Fuse TV, Fox News, CBS Morning Show, countless local press, and they're really getting an opportunity to see what it's like to promote something on the road, and that's an incredible experience for a kid. Where else are you going to get to go fly to Germany and play with the former members of Frank Zappa's band? Where else are you going to get to go to Lollapalooza and play with Perry Farrell and Leanne Rhimes? Where else are you going to get that opportunity? Nowhere.